In this video, we'll be taking a look at three MLB games happening on June 4, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three MLB games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Atlanta Braves vs. Arizona Diamondbacks The Atlanta Braves and the Arizona Diamondbacks wrap up their weekend series in Arizona on Sunday afternoon. The Braves are once again atop the National League East standings and look to be a threat to take home the World Series crown this fall. Arizona, meanwhile, continues to make improvements in leaps and bounds and has looked like a playoff contender from the start of this season. Atlanta is 3-7 in their last 10 road games and 3-8 in their last 11 games against a team with a winning record while the under is 4-0 in their last four Game 3 matchups. Arizona is 5-1 in their last six Game 3 matchups and 13-3 in their last 16 games against a team with a right-handed starter while the under is 13-5-1 in their last 19 home games against a team with a winning record. Gallen is coming off a great start where he tossed six scoreless innings and he has been lights out at home this season only giving up three runs in six home outings where he lasted 41 innings. Look for him to continue pitching well at home with a solid start in this series finale. Soroka is a field good story after missing more than two seasons and coming back from two Achilles tears. However, he was not sharp in his season debut and he will give up some runs in this game facing a solid Arizona lineup. Not often I'll pass up plus money with Atlanta, but I think the favorite price on the Diamondbacks is warranted as Gallon's been so good at home for the Diamondbacks this season. Michael Soroka also wasn't anything to be excited about in his return to the mound and I'm sure it'll be fine down the road, but this game isn't played down the road and in their current forms I have to side with Gallon over Soroka. The Diamondbacks will ride Gallon to a victory in this game and they will take the series. I would love to go with the Braves in this one but I simply cannot do it with Gallon on the hill, so the Arizona Diamondbacks Diamondbacks money line is our full game side pick. Gallon has been more than solid after getting tagged up in his first two starts. He has been dominant at home where in six starts he has only allowed three runs and 41 innings of work. He will have another solid home outing in this series finale. Soroka gave up four runs in his last start, which was his first in over two seasons. He will be decent but not shut down the Diamondbacks lineup. I spoke of Gallon's home brilliance this season but it is also important to point out that the game total has gone under in four of his six home starts this season. The Diamondbacks have gone under the total in five of their last seven games as well, heading into Saturday's game with Atlanta. Atlanta finished well under the total in game one of this series and has gone under the total in four out of their last five games. Arizona will get some runs but not many and the Braves lineup will be stymied by Gallon. This game will be far from a barn burner. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. Chicago Cubs vs. San Diego Padres The Padres host the Cubs for Game 3 of 4 on Sunday, June 4. San Diego has won three of their last five games entering Sunday. The Cubs have taken three of their last five. The two teams have split the first two games of the series. San Diego's Yu Darvish pitched a gem of a game against the Cubs on Saturday which led to an easy win. Chicago is 16-35 in their last 51 Sunday games and 10-23 in their last 33 games against the National League West while the over is 8-2 in their last 10 road games. San Diego is 1-5 in their last six home games while the under is 7-1 in their last eight games against the National League Central. Pitching was on full display Saturday night in San Diego. Darvish was in crystal as he allowed just one hit and I believe another gem of a pitching performance will be had on Sunday. The Cubs will be starting their ace Marcus Stroman. The right-handed pitcher has an earned run average of 2.59 this season in 12 starts. The Padres are a home run or bust team and with Stroman pitching, they struggle to find any contact. Stroman is allowing just 0.62 home runs per game. The Padres are starting lefty Ryan Weathers. The Cubs have found success against lefties this season as they are hitting .273 against South Paws. I'm not about to lay this kind of price with the Padres with Ryan Weathers as my starting pitcher and while Stroman's been better at home, his road earned run average hasn't been all that bad just a hair over three. Stroman's also looked far better in a lot of his recent starts and I think he delivers another solid outing here to get the Cubs the win on Sunday. 
So the Chicago Cubs money line is our full game side pick. The excellence in pitching for the Cubs along with the struggles on offense for the Padres will make this total hit the under on Sunday. The Padres are hitting the second worst batting average in the league. They have also struck out the 11th most times and it will show on Sunday as runs come at a minimum. The under is 5-0 in Cubs' last five overall. The under is 4-0 in the Padres' last four home games with the total set at 7-8.5. to The under has hit 13 times combined out of 18 combined starts for Stroman and Weathers. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. New York Yankees vs. Los Angeles Dodgers Tune into ESPN on Sunday night to see the Los Angeles Dodgers will host the New York Yankees at Dodger Stadium in a marquee interleague game to round out a three-game series. New York is 6-2 in their last eight road games and 3-8 in their last 11 interleague games against a team with a winning record while the over is 4-1 in their last five games overall. Los Angeles is 106-38 in their last 144 home games and 102-49 in their last 151 games overall while the over is 9-1-1 to to in their last 11 interleague games against a team with a winning record. I know the Dodgers have very high hopes for the career of Bobby Miller, but I'm siding with the more experienced pitcher in this marquee matchup between two powerful teams. Domingo German has had a lot of success in his career against players currently on the Dodgers roster. That includes Betts who is 0-for-1-2 lifetime against German, and Martinez who is just 3-for-1-7. The Yankees also have the best bullpen in baseball, with a minuscule earned run average of 2.85. New York's lineup is really impressive now that Stanton and Donaldson have returned to offer Judge even more protection. This is a Yankees squad that has put up 10 runs three times over the past week, and they are definitely a step up in competition for youngster Bobby Miller, who faced Washington in his last start. New York needs this win to keep pace in the stacked American League East division, and I think they'll get it. I like the Yanks pitching staff to clamp down on the Dodgers in this one, so the New York Yankees money line is our full game side pick. Both teams are on a roll offensively right now, including Los Angeles, which has seen the over his in six of its last seven games. On the year, the Dodgers over-under split is an impressive 34-23-1, to to which isn't a surprise considering they rank third in baseball in runs per game and have already reached 100 home runs on the season. These are two of the most powerful and deepest lineups in the major leagues, and we're bound to see more home runs on Sunday. Betts has really heated up for Los Angeles. On the mound for the Dodgers, though, we'll see if Miller has what it takes on the the biggest stage of his brief regular season career so far. This is a scary New York lineup now that they have key pieces back from injury. The over has hit in four out of New York's last five entering Saturday and in each of German's last three starts. Considering the number of superstars that will step into the batter's box, it's hard not to side with the over. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.